welcome back to the channel and today is going to be my second ever story time now this second story time is going to be it's going to be about how how my mama found out about one of my instas if you don't know what insta is it's basically an instagram account like it's not like well it's not necessarily that she found out about it it's like, like not necessarily she knew about it but like she found out about it so but that, let's not waste any time, let's get to the story time. So, so basically, this, I think this happened, it was like January 18th of like last year when this happened. I think it was, I think it was like, one time I was at home, I was just chilling, like playing my game, like it ain't done. It was until then, until then like my mom literally called me to the living room where she was at at the time. And then, and so basically like, to set the scene for y'all, it was like just me and my mom at the house at the time. I don't think like, Thing, like my dad was going all that so. so basically I think she had this look at her face like I think she was like pretty much mad basically the thing was like why she called me out he was like why like okay so she had this mad look at her face and she told me like she wanted me to be truthful like I was like what the hell like I was like what the hell is going on here in my mind I was like and it basically asked me about that, about that Instagram account, which, like, like, if you want to say that, it'll, it'll be the thumbnail of the video, and, like, and then, basically, like, it was basically another person who was involved in that, basically, which, her name was, the name was Sophia, at the time, so, like, now, I don't, I don't know no girl named Sophia at my school at the time, so, and then she asked me about the bounty thing, like, and also the chain and all that, which, which both of it, which I did, de I denied, like, I started to deny my mom, but then like she, she even had it though. And then basically, like, I tried to explain to her that it was all just a joke, and then you, you know, like, every, like every, every threat that people make, like, they take, they take it seriously, like, which is like, obvious, like, all, like, really obvious. That's like every point. So okay, so she she got she asked me about the change. She asked me about the bounty things, which I know both of those were illegal. Like it then and then from that point, like it got like extremely heated between between me and my mom. It's like we started fighting, like cussing each other out, and basically like like I think like the worst thing I ever said to her was like, which I'm not I'm not gonna say the actual words just to keep this channel clean and all that, but like. I think I think I should, which I'm sorry like basically like called her the B word like basically like and is that worse I I knew you was a you know and he was like and then my mom was like what did you just say and then and then I was like I didn't even say it did. but then like actually she heard what I said though And so, so basically, like, how did she find out? Basically, I think what happened was like, I think, I, th I think, I think what happened was, I think the principal, like, which I'm, I'm not gonna put his name out there. Basically, the principal for my school that I attended at the time, which was like last year, which was like January of 2020, basically called my parents because like some suspicious, it was like some suspicious or whatnot. So some suspicious, basically like me making threats and all that. I was like. <laughs> And then, and then, and then, and then I saw a little later and said, my dad literally called, I think at the time my dad was at work, and she literally called my mom, I think she literally called mom, and, and basically told her, told her that, like, she basically knew about, like, the, the situation and all that, so, and then basically, like, basically, like, like I, I think, I think I was, I was in the back room, basically, like, we didn't even want to be, like, like, she told me we had, I had to separate myself from her. She told me to go in that back room. I was like, and then basically like I could hear the conversations from from like from that phone specific phone call, and like, and it basically told her that I was a, basically like an Instagram thug, which I wasn't. I was like, I was like, that didn't even exist. So like, basically like if anyone if anyone watching was like to set the so basically to set the record straight like. 
I like basically like I made that particular Instagram account back then. It was just to get back at a couple of people from Twitter because they kept like you know with the beat basically. I'm not I'm not gonna say the word because there's just like no no point doing it. Basically like that account was like literally not to target anyone at school. And also like and also like it wasn't like basically like it was like that person who lived in another state that I was trying to get back at. Like it was like you know so it's basically like like they, they, that was just to set the record straight basically. So if you enjoyed this video please leave a like on it. Also if you want more story times hit that subscribe button. Turn on your notification bell for more videos coming in the future.